Hi, my name is Sam, and I'm an engineer here at National Instruments. If you're thinking about incorporating an NI X-Series device into your existing data acquisition system, I'd like to take just a couple of minutes to discuss some of the considerations to take into account when doing this. We've designed X-Series devices to work with your existing cabling, accessories, and software so that upgrading is easy and you can reuse your existing accessories. X-Series devices use NI DAC MX driver software, version 9.0 or later. This is the same easy-to-use software used by many National Instruments devices, including NIM series and NI Compact DAC. You can either install NI DAC MX from the included DVD or download it from NI.com. Make sure that you install NI DAC MX before installing the X-Series device into your desktop PC or PXI chassis. Now, let's take a look at the hardware considerations. X-Series devices are available in both PCI Express and PXI Express form factors. PCI Express X-Series devices use a BI1 connector, which means that you can plug it into any PCI Express slot from BI1 up to BI16. I've already shut down my desktop computer, so I can open up the case and look at the available slots on the motherboard. Here's my existing PCI device, and here's the PCI Express slot that we can use to install the X-Series data acquisition device. You can use PXI Express X-Series in either a PXI Express slot or a PXI Express hybrid slot in the chassis. X-Series devices use either a single or dual stack VHDCI connector, depending on how many analog and digital channels the device has. This is the same style connection used in M-Series DAC and several other NI devices. This means that I can take the cable that's plugged into an M-Series device and use it in my X-Series device with connectivity to the same screw terminal or BNC connector blocks. The pinouts for X-Series are backward compatible with M-Series. Next, Let's discuss the software considerations for adding X-Series to your DAC system. Once you've installed NI DAC MX, plugged in the X-Series device, and booted up your system, you can use NI Measurement and Automation Explorer for some basic configuration. Here, you can verify that the device has been correctly installed and view its device name. If you want to confirm that your signals are connected properly, you can use a test panel to immediately see the values. For your application to work with your newly installed X-Series device, you'll need the device name and measurement and automation explorer to match the function calls in your application. This means that you can either change the device name in measurement and automation explorer or change the function calls in your application. Here's an NI LabVIEW application acquiring data with an M-Series device. To acquire data from your X-Series device instead, you just need to change the physical channels input to your DACMX create channel VI. With NI X-Series, upgrading your existing hardware and software is easy, which preserves your investment in accessories and saves you time. 